Good morning from Cedar Hill State Park in Lola Palooza 2020. It's time for a little breakfast and then we'll get out and about. Y'all stick around. I'm gonna make breakfast burritos, but I wanna try this gator shake from Steve's Shake, Uncle Steve's Shake. Y'all can uh, visit his website at unclestevesshake.com. I'll put a link down in the description if you're interested in this. Give it a try. I'm fixing to. I'll let you know. So good, I forgot to tell you how good it was. Order yours today. Hey, y'all want to go check out Penn Farm Agricultural Center? Don't know what it's about. But let's go. All right, Penn Farm. There we go. We're going to check out the uh, South Green Ring and the old Penn Farm house and all kinds of stuff. Let's go for a walk. Looks like the bathroom's right there. Breaking the ground. Plowing leads to progress. Man, I'd have hated to ride on that steel wheeled bouncing machine. Check out the old fence. Kind of cool. And some more stuff over here. Let's go check this out. That's this. <laughs> Can't even talk. Sowing the seeds. You are here. Here. Let's say we we'll go this way. Yeah, this is kind of looks like old barns that I used to see. Maybe it won't be too dark in here. Well, there ain't nothing to go see. Hmm. Old wagon wheels. After the harvest preparation and celebration. And I miss my grandma's can and stuff. Used to make pear preserves, it was fantastic. Well, everything was fantastic, but those was really fantastic. Nice old house. The heart of the farm. The house was built in 1859. I was wondering. All they need is an old blue tick hound laying up here on the porch in a rocking chair. They'd be set. Maybe if I put it right up against the glass. I like these old porches like this. I even like the ones that wrap around better. But I don't like those.
<laughs> and the quest continues. Let's get a picture of it. Looks like an old chicken house. I'm not real sure. Yep. I was fixing to go back where we came from and I thought about it and we didn't see the back of the house. Let's check it out. There's a little barn out here. I miss these old screen doors. You should hear them things slamming. Real hardwood floors. Yeah, there's the farmhouse. And now we are going to go. What are we saying? This way? Well, I don't know. I want to see the main barn. Maybe that's that way. Yeah, well, let's go see. Love the old fence, so that's really cool. That's pretty neat. Little brake lever, lever. Pull that up. I think that the cedar. I don't know. Y'all know what it is. Let me know in the comments. Is it up there we can see. Pretty neat, pretty neat. Wow, that's a big barn. I was raised partly out in the country, but we didn't have a barn that big. That's even got stables in it. It even has electricity and picnic tables. <laughs> Metal ones at that, man, they were high, they were way ahead of their time. Wonder if you can go up in the loft. I guess we'll see. Hopefully, it's not too dark in here. Maybe this camera will adjust. Yeah, it looks like it is. Nomadic Fanatic got the new GoPro 9. Man, asked me if he thought it was worth the upgrade. He said definitely. I kind of wish he would have said no though. Because this show makes me want one. If y'all don't know who Nomadic Fanatic is, I'll leave a link down in the description and y'all can check out his channel. He goes all over the United States and looks for quirky things. Now, these are kind of quirky things for today's times. Man, it's dark. I don't know if y'all can see that. Maybe I can lighten that up and editing it. Right. No, you can't go up in the loft. Oh well. Ooh, look at that windmill. Love it, love it, love it. Gotta get a picture of that. Y'all stand by. So I guess you can have a pretty much a bonfire in that big old thing. Man, that makes my eyes burn just looking at it. I can almost smell it. 
your eyes really are burning, but I don't think it's from that, obviously, since it's not burning. Man, this stuff goes way back. What would y'all guess, brand-wise? I don't know. I wonder if it's got a name on it. <laughs> Still got spark plugs in it. I have no idea what kind of deal brand name pretty cool pretty cool wait no you know some old tractors you could take the gear shifter there uh, what was it Went to neutral in the middle and go to the all the way to the left and up and it would start I don't know if that one's that way man I thought the old rubber tires bounced bad but can you imagine solid metal wheels on some Texas hard clay <laughs> yeah that's a mower <laughs> Don't get your finger caught in that. There is no rubber tire. That's still older than what I'm used to. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah. It's a modern day looking house. Got a metal roof on it. Nice yard. I'd hate to mow it with that mower over there, though. There's a sign up here in the oh, it's office. Farm at our administration office. Talking about a sore of buttocks. Can you imagine? Whew. All day long in the field on that metal seat. Best not get up because that thing would be like an oven. We call it a griddle. Griddle. What kind of berries are them? Do you have any idea? Red rhymes are dead, so I'm gonna leave it alone. Alright, let's continue. What have we here? Another little red farmhouse. We can see in. Can't get in, that's for sure. Check for snakes. You don't see nothing moving. Yeah. Looks like just maybe the farmhand's house. Not bad, not bad. All you need right there. It might make a cool picture. Hang on. Well, I just looked at the picture I took of the map, and this was the end of the trail, pretty much. This was considered a day labor house. I don't know exactly why you'd need a house for day labor. Can't see in though, can you? Sorry. Yeah, let's continue. 
I didn't see that on this side of the barn. A uh, little corral. Let's get a picture real quick. It's what's left of a windmill. But you know, I don't really know that those windmills are that old. Because I think the old, old ones was wood. So, still very old though. Another barn. Oh. His stock. Must be, oh, okay. This is the dairy barn. The barn is one of the oldest structures on the Penn Farm, representing a pioneer family's first efforts to live and work in a new land. Big troughs. Real dark in here. Mm. Sometimes when I think about barns, I think, I wonder. What all plans were made, dreams were made, dreams were lost from sitting in the shade just thinking about life. First kisses, first broken hearts. y'all be able to see in here or not. Lots of chicken roosts. Right. I think that about wraps it up from pin farm so I'm going to head back to the truck in the meantime y'all keep on keeping on and I will see y'all down the road bye